Good morning, my friends. It's Melissa from Your RV Dream. And this morning, I thought I would share with you a little experiment that I did because just the other day, my neighbor and I were having a talk about RV toilet paper and about how expensive the RV toilet, the RV specific toilet paper is and how ridiculous that was. And I said, well, I just, I saw something online one time and I buy Scott's two ply which is, it's on the label, it says it's septic safe, and I think that works fine, but I never really tested it. So my neighbor said, why don't we test it out? So I've tested it out, and what I did was, using a water bottle, I put uh, about two sheets, about this much, um, toilet paper in with about a half a thing of water, and this is, let me get a little closer, this is the Scots, and it didn't break down right away, but pretty much, you can see, it's just cloudy water. It's pretty much all broken down. And that was overnight. And um, like I said, it didn't break down right away, but it did start breaking down in about an hour or so. By the next morning, nothing but gray water. And I really try not to shake it up very much because you, um, if you're not moving, your RV tank doesn't get shook up. So everything just sits there. So this was Scott's two-ply. And I'm not advertising for anybody or getting any... Um, uh, compensation for this video but it's just what I happen to use there are some other ones out there that you can use too um, and actually the reason I'm doing this video is to show you a way to do your own toilet paper test and make sure that you have something that's going to dissolve really good this my neighbor gave me two sheets or he actually put it in here two sheets of his RV specific toilet paper and as you can see it's still a lump of toilet paper and this was yesterday afternoon it's kind of starting to fall apart, like break up a little bit, but you can see the difference between the two now. This is RV specific, and it's obviously a lump of toilet paper, and this is Scott's septic safe, and it's all broken up. So I just wanted to kind of share that little video with you today. Whatever kind of toilet paper you're using, if you've got an empty water bottle or a soda bottle or whatever, Maybe not a beer bottle because uh, you can't see through that. Well, you can see through some of them. If it Maybe if it's a Corona. Anyway, so if you have an empty bottle, just fill it up, I don't know, about halfway. Put maybe two sheets, maybe this much, a um, little toilet paper in there. Leave it overnight. See what it looks like the next day. And you'll know whether your RV toilet paper is septic safe or not and whether it really breaks down. Sometimes I still see chunks when I, and I hate to talk about emptying the black tank, but sometimes I still see chunks, but I think that's just the more recent. Ew. Anyway, you want it to break down because you want everything to flush out good and you don't want a bunch of stuff sticking in there. Anyway, so that's today's little video. Just a short video I thought I would share with you and uh, have some toilet paper talk. Hope you have a wonderful day today. This is Melissa from Your RV Dream. Bye for now.